And more breaking news. A woman says she was driving down I-240 near Mount Moriah in southeast Memphis this afternoon when bullets started flying from another car. Thanks for joining us. I'm Elise Preston. Now, she was okay, but her boyfriend was shot. He's going to be okay, but she wants to know who would start shooting at her and on a busy interstate. WRG's Michael Quander is alive. Michael, this story is frightening. Yeah, sure is, Elise. It all ended right here at this Exxon gas station at Get Well in an American Way. If you take a look right here behind me, this was the closest place for those victims to come after that scary situation unfolded on the highway. Take a look at this video we shot earlier today. It all happened around 2 this morning. A woman and her boyfriend, again, were driving westbound on 240 from Mount Moriah when a black SUV pulled up beside them and started firing shots. One of those bullets hit the 26-year-old man sitting in the drive in the past passenger seat. The man uh, the, who was shot, well, he was rushed to the hospital in critical condition, but police said uh, he's improved since he's been there this morning. Now, this scary part about all of this is that the victims told police they don't even know who the shooter was or why anyone would want to hurt them. So, obviously, police need your help tonight. If you know anything, if you saw anything, give Crime Stoppers a call right away. That number, 901-528-CASH. And remember, you can report anonymously. Reporting in Southeast Memphis tonight, I'm Michael Quander, WRE News Channel 3. All right, thanks, Michael. We want to get to a breaking news update.